Hey guys, welcome to episode one of Defense Academy at Home. Uh, just a couple drills you all can do while on a break right now uh, to keep a stick in your hand and get better. Uh, hope you guys enjoy and get ready for episode two, uh, hopefully this week. See you guys soon. The first drill is cone GBs. Uh, all you really need for this is a, is a cone, and uh, you're going to put it in the middle, and there's four quadrants there uh, like the white line kind of represents. Uh, it's a great warm-up, something you should do, probably do every day, uh, and it's great for learning how to control a six-foot pole. Basically, what you're going to do, you're going to follow the yellow arrows, all right, and you're going to scoot it across using your shooters or your plastic. I prefer the shooters, uh, but you need to mix in both uh, to where you can tap it out to yourself and, uh, and pick it up. After you get done going right to left and then left to right, you're now going to combine them and pick it up and drop it down on the other side. Uh, really focus on speed here and get done quickly. And now we're going to move on to the three time goose or, or triangle goose. Um, what you're going to do, you're going to pull it across then pull it back to yourself and then pick it up. Uh, same sort of drill, but we're kind of adding a different element to it and uh, work on this. It may take some time, but work on building up your speed in this drill. Uh, start off slow, gradually get a little bit faster as you do it. Last but not least around the world, uh, make sure throughout all of these that you are completely in control of where the ball is going the entire time. Um, like I said before, if you need to go slower, do so. Um, but all you're doing here is combining everything and going all the way around the world with it. This next drill is called the Probert drill. All it really requires is a chair. So I'm sure you guys got chairs from summer tournaments uh, in your garage uh, that your parents sit on. Then put the ball underneath the chair, sprint up three yards, turn, and goose it out to yourself. Make sure you explode five yards after you pick it up and really try to go through the ground ball as fast as you can. 